Hey friends, this is Atif Hope here. Well and welcome to the new update on Zelica coin. In my last video, we were watching how the price line of Zelica broke out the down channel. And at the same time, it was also getting bounced by the support of a very big descending triangle. And in today's video, we will analyze if this move to the upside will be continued or we're going to move down back to test the support of this triangle again but before starting this analysis if you are not subscribed to my channel so far then do subscribe it and for more ideas you can also support me at the patreon because here i am sharing different trading ideas for you on the daily basis and you can find the link to join me here in the videos description i've shared so let's start this analysis first of all let me to show you this weekly live time frame chart and here we have already seen that we had a very nice support of this 200 simple moving average this yellow line is the 200 simple moving average and also the support of this descending triangle therefore the price line after testing this support of the very big descending triangle moved up and moved down and moved down again and now it is likely to have in other bounds and if we take a look at the daily time frame chart then it is forming a double bottom and after this double bottom we can expect a breakout from this triangle now if we take a look at the different oscillators like today i have also added the magd oscillator as well then we can see that previously this uh, stochastic was oversold here moved up again and again oversold now we are going to receive another buying signal by the stochastic because whenever this blue line crosses up this orange line that is a buying signal by the stochastic oscillator and especially when we receive this buying signal on the long term from the oversold zone that is considered as a very strong buying signal like we received here we had a very nice rally and here is the casting enter the oversold zone and again we received the buying signal we had a very very big rally and therefore uh, because as we also have a very very strong support of this triangle and we are going to receive a buying signal from the oversold zone therefore there will be a really very high probability that the price line will move up at least up to uh, make another attempt to uh, break out the resistance of this triangle now for example if the price line moves at the resistance that will be approximately at uh, 8.2 cents and for example if we will have a breakout that i am expecting that during this move we can expect a breakout because the movement is getting squeezed and more squeezed and as much it will be squeezed as much there will be chances that the price line can soon break out or break down the support or resistance now it depends from where it will break out for example if it will be bro uh, broken out from here then the move will be approximately here at 18.4 uh, cents and if we will have a breakout from here then our next target can be approximately here at 16.7 cents right now we are expecting a breakout approximately from here then our next target can be approximately 18 to 19 cents now let's take a look at the weekly magd then we can see that on this weekly lifetime frame chart magd has started turning bullish again previously when it turned bullish here we had a very nice rally and here it's it again started turning bullish from a strong bearish to big bearish that is a bullish signal but it turned bearish again and the price line uh, was forming a double bottom it was moving down to touch this bottom or support again and now after touching here it has started turning bullish again that is another buying signal and if we take a look at the four hourly time frame we have already seen that here on the four hourly time frame the price line has broken out there's a resistance of a down channel and and now after this breakout we can expect that this move will be continued our target can be here approximately at this resistance that is at 8.3 cents where we have this resistance of this uh, uh, descending the big bigger one the descending triangle as well so this was the update so far i hope that you have liked the analysis then do hit the like and do subscribe to the channel as well and for more ideas you can also support me at the patreon because here i am sharing different trading ideas for you on the daily basis and you can find the link to join me here in the videos description i've shared take care goodbye